Welcome to Wednesday. We got up this morning pretty early, 7 a.m., uh, to come down here to the Grand Depot Cafe, is what it's called, the Hotels Cafe. The line to get into this place is, is crazy, crazy long. There's probably like 30 or 40 people in line trying to get in the door. Uh, it's buffet style. They have chocolate chip pancakes, which I'm pretty excited about. I think Mark and Rhonda decided to sleep in this morning. We've got about an hour and then we're going to be on the train. Don't know how long we're on the train. We're going to be taking the train all the way up to the Grand Canyon today. I'm doing a lot of walking. And now really wants to go back to the precise location where we were denied entry at the Grand Canyon three years ago. I think we should. I don't know how long of a walk it'll be, but I think it'll be a lot of fun. All right, look what I found, boys. Look what I found. <laughs> I don't know about the rich part, but you got that building part there. Right? Yeah. yeah. All right, look, I'm going to deal up the parts. Why don't you go explain the rules? By the way, did you guys hear that Willie got hit by a car last night? No. He was playing on the road again. <laughs> on the road again. It was right here, Mel. Yep. Three years ago that we stood. Tried to see the Grand Canyon. We tried to see the Grand Canyon and it just flooded. So now, three years later, hopefully we'll be able to actually see the thing. <laughs> there it is. It took three years, but we finally, finally get to see it. God, that, now that is so big. <laughs> like, down there, like you see individual trees, yeah, and they look tiny. You can't even see where the river is right now. Holy cow! Wow, The thing that's crazy is that it just seems to go on forever because we've been walking along the path mm -hmm. and it just it never ends. It I'm just keeps you. going and going. I'm not gonna hey little buddies. <laughs> I think he's got places he's got places to be. It just feels like it goes on forever. It practically does.
envisioned, a, I guess, a bullet train, which it's not. It's very old. In fact, the car that we're riding in is uh, 30? 1923. 1923, which is pretty old. You have so many shoes. So many tiny shoes. I have three pairs. Oh man. Well, we just got back. <laughs> you look like a white Christmas with that hair. <laughs> <laughs> um, what'd you think of the Grand Canyon? I loved it. Was it cool? Yeah, it was really cool. It was, I mean, I know I said it before, but like it's, it's such a weird thing because like you can't comprehend how big it is. It's well, just so big. It, it's bigger in person. You know, I've seen pictures and video of the Grand Canyon, and it's just, it's, you have to experience it for yourself. And it is one of those weird things that, you know, you start taking photos of it, and you're like, wait, these are all... The, they look yeah. the same. Yeah, yeah, and it's, it doesn't detract from how beautiful it is, but I think that beauty is probably best experienced in person. But, anyway, we're back now. Train ride was interesting. Train got robbed. Um, voluntarily robbed. <laughs> voluntarily robbed. It was an interesting experience. <laughs> I liked how the guy said, have you all been fleeced enough yet? Because <laughs> like one group came through and, and the then, second group came through. Yeah, I was wondering, the, yeah, there were two train robbers that come through and then everyone like gives them a dollar, if you want. And then randomly, like a few minutes later, another set of train robbers came through and I was like, well, where were you the first time? But um, now we're back, we're going to kind of relax for about an hour, and then uh, gonna go do dinner somewhere. Yeah. We came to Historic Brewing Company for dinner, and um, I gotta say, I, I'm gonna talk about mine first. I get a Cuban, and it's probably one of the best Cuban sandwiches I've ever had. It's really, really, really good. Uh, Mal, you and your dad both got pulled pork. You guys tend, you guys said it was good? My fourth attempt at trying to find a beer off that list on my <laughs> Mark, Mark tried so many beers. But you found one. I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> and Rhonda, you have a salad, but you I have, have like a... Before. You had a very special concoction yeah. made, which so, confused the waitress. I think it's... Well, it's basil infused tequila. Yeah. With mint. Vermouth? Vermouth. It's a martini. And something else. Cucumber? <laughs> cucumber, yeah. But cucumber. maybe the cucumber, no, it's cucumber was cucumber cucumber cucumber. infused tequila with mint and basil and vermouth. Which is certainly unique. Yes. <laughs> now back in the room, it is 9 p.m. Uh, we're going to get a shower and then go to bed. Uh, the objective tomorrow is to be on the road by 9. And are we heading to Page? Yep. Is that in Utah? No, it's on the border. That's So that's still in Arizona? Yeah. But at some point, we're going to... Utah. I think so. Maybe. So uh, tomorrow we're going to be heading up to uh, up to Page, and um, we're going to be in a big house, um, meeting up with more of Mallory's relatives. So uh, it's going to be a, a full house, from what I understand. There's going to yep. be a lot of people staying under one roof, so it should be a lot of fun. And that starts tomorrow. Thanks for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?